Hello techies, this is Usman from a server mentor with another brand new video. I'm going to teach you how you can create a dedicated server to create or host your WordPress website for free on Linode. Linode is actually a very well known cloud provider which provides dedicated hosting servers at very cheaper rates. Now let's find out how to create WordPress server on Linode. First of all, you need to sign in to your Linode account. If you have already not registered with Linode, please check out my other video in which I have told you how to create an account on Linode to get free $100 credit for 60 days. The link is already given in the description. Please check that out. Now, once you have created your account, please log in to your Linode account. I will use my Google account to log in. After logging in, you will be presented with this dashboard. Now to create your WordPress server, click on create Linode here. Click on marketplace. And click on WordPress here. You will require an email address to register with WordPress. This email address will be used to log into your This email address will be used with your WordPress account. Type in a WordPress administrator name and type a password. MySQL password is also required. You need to set that as well. You can use the same password for MySQL root as well, but I would recommend that you choose a different password for MySQL. Then you need to choose WordPress database password. Again, this will be a different password from WordPress administrator or MySQL root password. Choose a website title. Choose a sudo user if you want to create one to manage your server from CLI. I'm good without it. Okay, please make sure if you do create a sudo user, then it will be better if you disable this root access, but I'm not going to create a sudo user. So I'm not disabling root access for SSH. Type in your domain name here. Select an image. This is basically an operating system image and Linode provides you two options here. One is with Ubuntu uh, latest version and other one is Debian. You are free to choose any one of these. I'm good with Ubuntu. Pick a region of your choice. I'm going with Frankfurt. Pick the server specs of your choice. I would go with the shared CPU and with Linode 4 GB. You can see that you will be charged $20 per month for this one. But don't worry as your account already has $100 for 60 days if you sign up with my given link. Then scroll down a little bit and choose a Linode label. I'm good with the default label and choose a root password. Now remember this root password is for your Linode server. You will need to use this password when you will try to SSH into your server using command line. Please do not mix this password with your WordPress administrator password. Scroll down a little bit. No need to change anything else. Click on this little check. I have read and agreed to the Linode terms and conditions and click on create Linode button. It will take a few moments to create your server. As you can see that the status is provisioning, you will see that status will change soon into running. So let's wait for a few moments. Okay, so now you can see that the status has been changed to running. Copy this IP address and map it with your domain name. Go to your domain registrar's website. In my case, it's Cloudflare. So I will open Cloudflare website.
click on add record button here type at the rate here for your root domain and paste the IP address here and click on save button now this may take a few moments maybe one or two minutes so let's wait so that our domain links with our new IP address let's copy this domain name and open it in another browser you can see that the website title is changed to what we changed before my server mentor blog and wordpress is already installed in on our domain to get into wordpress panel go to the url your domain name slash wp admin and type in your username and password you have created on Linode's dashboard console. Okay, we have logged into our WordPress administration panel. From here, you can update your plugins, upload your themes, or upload your WordPress website files. If you need to access your server over SSH, you can do that by using a third-party SSH client like PuTTY or using the Windows command prompt or using any other SSH client. Okay, so it, this was it guys. I hope that you have learned how you can create a WordPress dedicated server on Linode and try and use it for 60 days without any cost. Now, if you want me to show you how you can create SSL certificate with your domain on this server, please subscribe to my channel because I'm making another video on how you can create SSL certificate and attach it with your domain on this server. If you liked my video, please hit a like button. If you have any questions, please do ask me in the comment section below and subscribe to my channel as it will help me grow and share more knowledge. I'll be back with another video soon. Until next time, goodbye.